everyone, and welcome back to Wolf Quest 3. Are we here? What is that sound? With Tiger Eye Iguana and their three pups. Rabbit. <gasps> Rabbit's digging. Oh my gosh. Uh, Bumblebee and Tahitian. Is that no? That's Grizzly Bear Sun. And we have just gotten back from marking a bit of territory. Ooh, we should mark up there. How tired are we? Eh. About the energy, we should probably hunt as well, because two of us don't really have enough food. Definitely keep this hex protected as well. Sorry, I forgot like the button for um like come with. Come on, why can't you do this with uh why can't you do this with ebony? I'm wondering though. Did they fix it? No. Unfortunate. Alright, uh, we were not going this way. We were going that way up to there. Cause why not? Oh, actually that's like three hexes away. Yeah, we shouldn't need to worry too much about over there. Ooh. You know what? Since they're mostly nocturnal, let's go down to the sky water and see if we can grab a beaver, since the best we can really smell right now are mule deer and rabbits. The mule deer scent seem decently far away. Is this a beaver trail? Probably not. See how far away it is from the water. Like, no, that's not the water. They're heading toward the water though. Oh, so recently I have discovered something. Apparently, here's a beaver trail, I believe. Let's see, sand view. Prospect Peak, not too odd actually. Should be good there. Better be iguana, yeah. Alright, I'm decently sure that that's not a beaver trail. Maybe. Oh, no. oh yeah, it was a beaver trail because there were, uh, there was beaver scent on it before. Okay, so yeah, if we wait, like. It's right over here. Maybe we'll be good. Maybe we'll find something. But something I've discovered is that for the most part, you can actually play the game Denless, which is something I found to be really interesting. And something that I thought we might actually do at some point. Um, I'm honestly just like really worried though, cause I feel like that would be really difficult. So I'm definitely not confident 
about it. How good is our affinity? 44% and... Ooh, they're getting hungry now. I think, like, when you lay down, the time goes by slightly quicker, because uh, I don't think it went down 2% for each of them already when we went, like, a little bit over there. But yeah, affinity-wise, we should be okay. If you look super, super closely at the stars, you can see them moving. really getting anywhere with this right now. Although it does definitely require some patience, it's just... It's not quite dawn yet. Oh, well, dawn is coming, so... I think at dawn and dusk, I like to wait definitely a lot longer than other times. Alright, you need to move over to this side of the beaver trail. Because no. now the scents are all blowing this way, so if we did that, we wouldn't be able to let them it is close, like we'd be doing this and they just smell us. Let's snush you here. Dawn is very slowly coming. Yeah, it definitely goes, time definitely goes by at least a bit faster. Speed one. Hoping that that added speed and strength helps Tigray in her fights. Because uh, I don't know exactly what it is, like what the difference between her and say Emerald is in a fight, because Emerald is like dominating all of her fights for the most part. So it's like, watch this just not be a beaver trail. So I'm decently certain I saw like scents come down here before. I swear I'm not crazy. It like has a different music, like make Don come faster, please. <laughs> oh, ouch. Right. Yeah, as soon as we get the little pop up warning thing, we'll just bolt back. We're not so far away that we have to be too. Okay, we're we're not in the same hex for whatever reason. I thought we were in the same hex, but yeah, right now we're definitely good. Sight, but... <sighs> I was thinking about which one of like our past wolves would have done that, like. 
And I was thinking maybe gold had a chance of doing that. <sighs> like she might have done that. You know, if that was an option in Wolf Quest 2.5. Uh, Storm definitely wouldn't have. Oh yeah. I'm also thinking about making a little, like a little side series thing where it's like, or just like a little side thing in general where I just kind of like take thunder and like find a silver and then just go through Wolf Quest 3 like that and then go through with Storm and Gold, find Citra and Cloud and then yeah. And let's see how uh, Cole and by more extension, by further extension, their dead children would have looked. I'm also really sad that we didn't get um, to play with copper. Poor Storm, honestly, like, poor girl, I, like, I thought, I'm not, <sighs> I'm not entirely certain how we were supposed to chase off that bear, because, like, in 2.5, there's at least, like, a reason or rhyme to these things, like, there is a specific like a way to do these things like bears wouldn't even show up oh okay never mind yes they showed up quite often but like I swear ooh eighteen percent yeah we might be heading off soon but I take that as proof that that's uh, definitely going by a little slower than uh or a little faster than we're used to, I should say. Oh yeah, and since they're in the den for so long, our fleas are getting racked up a lot more than they usually would. We're just, uh... For just three pups. Can we talk about that? Like, the yellow cards have prospered this last year, and then we're over here with, like, litters of two and three, which, like, I'm not complaining, considering we're definitely going for much bigger territories this time around, although with Tiger Eye, it was more give territory, like, and that was kind of all it was, but still. Breeze did that, too. Ooh, respond, grizzly bears. Come on, Don. Come faster. Yeah, I think in the future we're gonna try to kind of lose the traditional naming thing a little bit. Just a little bit. By that I mean, like, allow, like, the names, for example, to, um, to influence the pup names. So, like, with Iguana, we let that kind of influence the other two, two out of three of the pup names to be animals or bugs, but whatever. <laughs> I had like 10 names ready, like that were animal related. Like I was slightly hoping we got like a five, maybe even six pup litter there. It's snowing. I 
berries come out in the snow? Alright, that's the end of that. Let's go. Okay, so like ten, nine, ten percent. Dang it. Uh, probably would have gone better off tracking down the mule deer. Although the mule deer were already kind of leading us this way ish. Yeah. I think the stress is going to be a lot less. With less pups, because we are going to have to worry less about food. You know, as long as we actually keep them fed. No, no, they're going to leave the now. We can't hunt. This isn't like we're just giving up. This is like we're giving up because we have to. go over there and then we'll get some sleep even though they don't want sleep they've been sleeping and now they want out they want to know where their parents are they want to know where their parents aren't there yet i'm honestly kind of tempted to sit here and wait and see who will come up first bumblebee really now That's a massive surprise, honestly. Hey, Bumblebee. Yeah, see, we don't have the food. Neither does Iguana. I'm go ahead and head to sleep and hope. I swear if I done floods already. <laughs> I, mean, I don't think it will, but still. Just make sure before we play. Alright, yeah, we're good. Already at like seven pounds for Tahiti and Bumblebee. Goodness. Ouch, and they're actually really hungry and we don't have food, so... Oops. <gasps> oh! Go first, higher. Grab it. Look at Bumblebee. <laughs> so, I believe, if I remember correctly, we got the fun parrot one. Yes, okay. Ah, uh, look at Iguana. He's so pretty. Yeah, something I'm noticing is that ever since uh, Cole, we had mostly black, like, wolves and pups. And airs. See, a good thing about the fun parent thing is that we don't have a cooldown. Alright, grab it. We're gonna bring you just a little bit this way. Um, Iguana's keeping an eye on Bumblebee. Yeah, and I'm so glad to do this, so I count that as okay. Too bad yet. I think that's good enough. I don't think Bumblebee heard me. No. Oh. <laughs> I 
I could just imagine um, Tahiti and just tumbling down the hill. can smell mule deer, we just gotta hope that they're not, like, over in here. Oh, wait. There's stuff, I believe those are the trees, like, right there, that the, uh, the thing was at. Goodness, the one time I don't check the map right after waking up. I think this might be around the site. Looks like lightnings. There's a small chance. Mm. We'll pee on the rock. And then it'll be fine. There we go, see, it's fine. I think we would sleep again if, uh, you know, we weren't all, like, dying of starvation. <laughs> Like, we're not dying of starvation, but we're hungry. Oops. Looks like some of them branched off that way, so we're gonna follow the ones that didn't. Oh, uh, then they came back, so. 15 minutes. 15 minutes. How close are we to- alright, yeah. We should be fine. We're gonna hope that the speed is part of what was kicking Tiger's tail. Although extra speed definitely does good for us. Uh, There we go. Good job, Taker. Oh, I will actually be right back. I am sorry. My apologies.
Okay, ducks. Hello. Sorry about that. Let's go ahead. I think the carcass might get completely eaten up between um, Tigra and Aquana right now. Considering how hungry they are, the little fox in the corner is like, don't mind me. So if I could. Yeah, no, we just completely destroyed that. Ooh, yeah, the waiting there definitely took a toll on our flea count. Alright, we're mostly full though. We're probably gonna need to come back just for more food later, but for now. For now, we're full. It's bison. Oh, hello. No hunting the bison. We cannot add the bison. How about no attacking the bison, actually? See, I think out of every one of our current wolves, because, like, Tiger is mischievous and playful, but she's more distractible and curious than anything. Rabbit? I have questions. To he in, lucky boy. Really? I hate it when they do that, like they just got fed. And then they demand more food. Like when they haven't taken a bite out of what they're given. Bumblebee, I'm sure Rabbit would like to share. Oh, come on. He ate the same stuff I did. Ouch, Bumblebee. Come on. Oh, is it the fact that there's a single bunny stuck in there somewhere? Come on. Was he, was he gnawing at the berries? Was he grabbing berries off the ground over there. He probably was. <gasps> I could so imagine Bumblebee favoring berries over like anything else. There we are. It was a bit of a risk taking that photo, but Rabbit, don't go too far. Actually, Rabbit, uh, Hey, you're in another hex. Uh, that doesn't matter too much, though. Considering we're, like, great here. Imagine, like, going into another hex was counted as wandering off, and then it's like, Rabbit has wandered off as she's, like, just over the border. Oh, I really hope her den didn't just flood. I really hope her den didn't just flood. That better be a bunny that I just saw. I think it was. Oh, ouch. No, you guys. Guys, I really, really think that feeding can wait. Tahitian? Okay. Go on, don't be mad. But, um, I'm worried. That territory struck down. There's territory heading straight towards our territory. Uh, I think we're gonna go this way more first, cause... And then we can hit that if we want to, and then we can head over there. Really, though, we should be moving down more. Yeah. So if we end up moving... Oh, actually, no, if we end up moving, we're gonna end up moving this way, which, uh, I don't think the Prospect Peak Wolves know where we live, so they're probably looking at that den to see if we live there, but, uh, let's go ahead. So, yeah, if we end up moving, we're gonna be moving over there, and then we're gonna be maybe carving out a bit more territory that way. 
I don't think Tiger is caring as much about having a big string territory as Ebony is, and Emeralds was a bit more just like this is territory needed for my quest. Oh yeah, okay, hold on. Let's turn the music down again. But, um, we actually got our friend a new beta. Uh, and we actually named it Pisces. Uh, huh. We will peak dispersals. Hmm. There's food. I'm a tad bit more concerned with territory right now, but hunting food will always help with territory, so. It's a win win. Nice job, Iguana kind of saved Tiger Eye from uh, twisting around there. Bunny over there, hoping I won't get seen. It's already spotted, which oh. I think. Yeah, that definitely helped a bit. Hopefully, alright. What's left here is gonna be. And I took a chunk away. That's a rock over there, right? What was even a rock? It was like the jutted out underneath of a tree stump. Alright, yeah, something's over there. And it's gotta be a pack wolf because dispersals don't do this much damage to a territory. Contrary to Jasper's sight belief. So, come on. Some post I find it. Alright, yeah, it's just right over here. And no need to make a new one. It's close enough right now. Should be good. Yeah, so well, I mean, it was at fifty A and B. Alright, yeah, there are definitely wolves there, although that is right next to our spawn hex, so I'm not too surprised. I think at some point we might actually just move over here ourselves, although I do quite like the den we're at, so I'm not entirely fond of the idea. It's just a possibility, because it'd be safer. There have to be wolves here. But there's wolves that were through here. Just not sure where. Move the sun post over here. And we'll go over there. Kinda 
may end up crossing through here and we'll have a little bit here if we do and then He's hungry enough to have a bunny. Iguana. Is he trying to play Val? I think he's trying to play Val. I wish that there'd be, um, like an affinity raise for, like, when you and your mate eat the same prey. Or, or like, from when, um, when your mate eats something that you caught. Like, just for, like, bunnies and, like, beavers. And for the smaller foods. It's like you're sharing food. Be happy with each other. Is there some post right over there somewhere? Uh, hey, oopsie doops, nope, stop that. Ah, small awkward. Nice. Eat me, no curry. It's good to know that's there. Doing okay. We're doing okay. So let's, yeah, I'll you know, just flat out mark this. Cause why the frick not? How's that doing? Yeah, there's definitely a wolf at the very least in here. Uh, how hungry are they? They're decently hungry. I start, I feel like like time goes by quicker or something when you have fewer pups. What's that? We will peek back. Okay, we already knew that they were down there ish. Hit the sun post here too. Not in the sex, but the next sex. I think we're actually probably going to end the episode after that because it's getting uh, pretty long. Let's go ahead. Alright, no. Okay, yeah. We need to get over there before we lose that hex. Come on. Let's go. I'm also going to be absolutely shocked if there's no one in there. Like, shocked to no degree. You know, like, every degree. I know English. I woke up, like, an hour ago. Okay, guys. Give me a break. This is why I shouldn't record right after waking up. We've established this many, many times. Do I ever listen to this, to these establishments? Oh, no. No, I do not. Okay, let's go, let's go, let's go. On. Just get us in the hex at the very least. God. We're so close. Prospect Peak. There we are. Get out. I am failing at grabbing this wolf. A sister. Sister with radio call.
uh, our sub host hasn't died quite yet, but I want it to be just a tad bit closer. Let's head back. And this guy is... Oh boy. I hope you all enjoyed this video. I hope you all have a wonderful, wonderful day. Um, let me know what you think about just kind of voluntarily moving over here where, we're, where we'll be a bit further away from the Prospect Peaks and our spawn hacks, I believe. Okay, we won't be too much further away, but in general, we'll be a tad bit further in their area. I, should, I feel like it'd be a bit better to go in here, because we have, like, two hexes on each side over here. You know, excluding that thing. Although I think I'd still possibly count that as two hexes. Um... Mm. Yeah, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you all have a wonderful, wonderful day. Let me know what you think about moving over to the more uh, secure, protected den. Probably look at it in the next episode. And, oh, I keep it done. I will see you all next time. Uh, Bye-bye!